The university today has just remarkable momentum. You think about where we've come in the last decade and it's just breathtaking. That progress would simply not be possible without the strong partnership between gifted administrators and faculty and deans and very loyal alumni, many of whom serve in visiting committees. Joining a visiting committee, uh, being a member of a visiting committee, is an opportunity uh, to both learn about, uh, be engaged with, and contribute to uh, the development of a particular area of the university. People come from all walks of life. There are lawyers, there are uh, financial people, there are uh, artists, theologians, business people. We share an interest in the university. I think on any visiting committee that you are a friend of the university, you, make a, you write checks to the university because you support what they do, and, uh, and you want a, the university to prosper, and you want the kids to prosper. We're very involved in advising the dean and supporting the dean, which is pretty unique among most educational institutions where we get to see the whole picture of what's being offered in the social sciences. It has been said, although I officially deny it, that I'm taking them to Paris and to Vienna and Barcelona to enable them to have fun. It's a combination of business and pleasure. To the extent that these people are my counselors and my advisors, they ought to know what we're doing abroad. And the best way to do that is to take them abroad rather than bring abroad to Chicago. To be asked for your opinion about something and to be listened to and have your opinions be implemented is, is not a very frequent thing. One of the um, most exciting things for my visiting committee has been watching the Mansueto project literally from the time it was a hole in the ground to its completion and feeling that we had a part in it. We were taken seriously. We were shown all the plans. Everything was explained to us. We felt included and valued. Our biggest job, frankly, is to advocate and to be effective advocates for the university. The Humanities Visiting Committee partners with me as dean. They learn about who we are, what we do, and they help us explain the value of humanistic inquiry. We wanted the Social Sciences the Visiting Committee to be more than a reactive uh, group. So instead of showing up at meetings and just listening, we started to say, what is it you really want to do to help the Physical Science Division? And we all began to realize that one of the most important things of our lives was being made offered to us. That we could work with a world-class institution, with world-class scientists who come and tell us their stories and then tell us what they need, and then we, somehow through our lifetime, have learned how to make a difference to help them. We have done some things where we've in, invited Mark or others to come in and hosted dinners, you know, just to create some sort of a sense of presence among some potential donors or even other, other visiting committee members. There's something here. There's something that you'll learn. There's something that you'll experience. There's something that you will enjoy. There's some way that you will grow, too. For the university to succeed in the future, to succeed at the highest possible level, to fulfill all of our aspirations, to fulfill our highest ambitions. The visiting committees play an essential role. I see it as being my devotion to the university, my willingness to work for it, and to be a part of the effort to keep it going and keep it strong and keep it the wonderful University of Chicago that it is.